baseball fans and welcome. The show has AAA baseball for you. It's the Toledo Mud Hens taking on the Columbus Clippers. First pitch coming at you right after the break. So just about set now. Here's the shortstop at the play. Zach Short. The wind of the pitch. So a foul ball makes it one and two. The wind to kick the pitch. Just off the outside edge. Really good take, especially with two strikes. And here it comes. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. One out in the top of the first. Here's the second baseman, Cody Clemens. 3-2 now. No score just getting started top of the first. And he walked him. Now this was a story we were paying attention to before the game. We've seen him give up walks in the past and it's an issue once again early on. One down. And now here's a speed threat. Outfielder Jacob Robson. Belton fires and he chases that one now two out man at first here's Riley Green the pitch slapped foul 3-2 two, two out runner on first a lot of movement in the infield hitters got to stay focused on the pitch And he hits a ground ball right side. Base hit. That was smoked through the infield. Throw in holds the lead runner at second. Two on now with two away. First and second, two down. And now the first baseman, Josh Lester. And he deals. Fly ball down the line. Brennan moving under this one. Drops into the glove. And the inning is over. We go to the bottom of the first. And now number 67. pitches downstairs right hander kicks deals that's inside and now three and one that's through there for a strike payoff pitch that one misses so a lead off walk what a battle. It's not always easy laying off a 3-2 pitch, and I tell you what, he earned that walk. Trenton Brooks, the next to hit. This one in the dirt. Save! Man at second. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. pitch the just off the outside edge full count now hammered and now maybe extra bases and they'll score first it's one zip and in its second with an RBI double well, they strike first as he gets the job done to bring home the run. He got a pitch he could get to out front, kept his bat through the ball, and didn't pull off or roll his hands over. And that allowed him to rip that ball down the line.
Now this one's crushed down the line. Hooking foul ball. Well, that ball is hit pretty hard and sure had home run distance, but if you're the pitcher out there on the mound, you execute it. Just a long strike. You go after him and finish him off. Got him swinging. And that's the first out. And now it's Josh Naylor. Kicks and deals. In the air, right field. Pretty well struck. That's on its way. And that one is gone over the right field wall. That's what the fans came to see. And they add a couple more. It's 3-0. Here's the left fielder, Will Brennan. And there's ball four. Boom, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you enough at-bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. The kick and the pitch. Runner goes. Go to second. Well, with this many pitches thrown here in this first inning, I mean, you're giving the other team a really good look. He's going to have to find a way to get some weak contact, maybe a swing and miss, get into that dugout and hit the reset button. Two down, nobody on. And a foul ball, he stays alive. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. here at the ballpark new inning getting started Isaac Paredes now well after putting up a nice inning on offense got some runs across this is where you look for the starter to go out there have a shutdown inning don't give that other team any hope uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning get the bats back up there while they're hot makes the catch and there's one gone Daz Cameron at the plate The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. And a count one and two. The pitch. Stays alive. The one, two. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Two up, two down at the top of the second. Two outs, base is empty. Now, number two. Next one misses, ball two. That one to first. He handles it himself, and that is that. Welcome back. And now, Ernie Clement. And a pitch. On the ground to short. Now the throw to first on the run. Leadoff man retired here in the second. Here's Tyler Freeman to hit. Not shortstop. Tyler Freeman. Next one is off the plate, and yeah, that's ball two. One down, base is empty. Fouls one off, two and two. Righty to the plate. They tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. On the ground right side. Tosses to first. Already two out here in the home half of inning number two. Here's Luke Maley. And Chris, his big strength is defense. But it is interesting. In today's world of baseball, compared to when you played, a good defensive catcher is considered differently. Whatever you get offensively is a bonus. But he's got to put the fingers down. He's got to present pitches to the umpire. They're going to help his pitcher get more strikes. And the righty deals. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Yeah. 
Welcome back. On to the third inning. Now, here is Dustin Garneau. Two and two. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. One away. Now it's Zach Short. The 2-2. Two -two. And there's a ball. On the ground to third. Fires across the diamond. Two up, two down. Good sinker low in the zone right there and produced exactly what he was looking for. Ball on the ground. Nice ground out. Cody Clemens will hit next. Worked a walk in his first trip to the plate. Next offering is in for a strike. Kicks and fires. Got him. And that is that. Set for the bottom of the third. And now the center fielder, number 67. Well, he's back out here for the third, and after the first couple of innings, pretty rough. I think the skipper's looking for him to give him a little bit of length, see if he can save the bullpen song. And that's ball four. Second walk of the game for him, and he's been really patient at the play, a game plan that he's sticking to. He's just not going outside of what he's looking for up there. Ball to strike. Taps softly to the right side. Lester. And he beats the throw very close right there. Now here's Nolan Jones. He struck out swinging at his first at bat. Next one is off the play. Two and one. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Swing at a ball lifted to center field. And he makes the catch. And there's one down. And next will be the cleanup hitter, Josh Naylor. He's already homered in this one. Fouled off again. And it remains three and two. Left hand batter waits. In the air, pretty deep out to center field. Green settles under it and makes the catch. And there's two down. Now the left fielder, Will Brennan. The bat. The left fielder. Will Brennan. Two outs. That one oh. missed. Number 67 on second. Number 38 on at first with two down. He swings and hits a fly ball. Center field. Robson sizes this one up. Racing makes the catch. And that will end the inning. Back here at the ballpark. Here's a speed threat. Jacob Robson. Left-hand hitter waits. Now one fouled off. Two and two. The pitch. And that's outside. Expect for that guy to come right at you with a fastball, something in the zone, because he does not want to allow the leadoff wall. Line to left, and that should be extra bases. Throws to second, and he's going to get to second with nobody out. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. And the batter now, Riley Green. Swing and a pop-off in foul ground. Makes the grab on the run. And there's one down. And here's the first baseman, Josh Lester. Pretty good job on the mound in this one, Siggy. It feels like we've seen a lot of off-balance swings. Yeah, just one free pass, and uh, obviously he's not a big strikeout guy, but he gets soft contact, and he gets out. Next pitch misses. 
And the count is three and one. Runner leads away at second. The other way. And that's just foul. One out and a runner at second. And it's ball four. He missed down low. Well, he took his chance at getting him to chase right there. But with first base open, walk not a bad thing. He set up a double play opportunity if he can induce a ground ball. The pitch. High fly ball, right field. Brooks brings it in. And there's two away. So first and second with two outs. Daz Cameron digs in now. On the ground, right side. Clement over to pick it up. They take the force out. That's the third out. four now it's the DH David Fry it looks like the weather could actually play a factor in this one it's coming down pretty good yeah it is and it's not too bad yet but the field's not going to be able to hold up if the rain gets any worse than this so keep an eye on the pitcher's mound as well and the rest of the infield start to puddle up a little bit strike two he has a tendency to chase out of the zone and that slider that's down that's one of his money pitches to get that swing and miss Foul ball there. The wind of the pitch. In the air on the infield. Lester makes the grab. And there's one down. Ernie Clement getting ready to hit. There's a 1-1. One, one. Pretty well in the air out to center. Green gets under it. Puts the squeeze on it. And there are two down. Stepping in, Tyler Down's Freeman. Back. Grounded out his first time. The 1-1. One, one. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, it will be a very positive sign for him and for his team. 2-1 pitch is in there, and the count is even. Number two. Drop steps, heads back on it. Squeezes it, and that ends the inning. Ready now for the fifth inning. Now it's the right fielder, number two. Falling behind two and one. And a pitch. Swings and sends a rocket to right. Brooks puts the squeeze on that one. And there's one away. And now here is Dustin Garneau. 0 for 1, he struck out swinging last time. Next offering is in for a strike. And a pitch. And fouled off. Fouled off down the right side. Next offering is fouled back. That hits the dirt, and it's two and two. The punch out there, two down. And the batter will be the shortstop, Zach Short. Next offering is downstairs. 
That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Here comes a pinch. And there's a foul ball. Looking sharp just to strike away from five shutout innings. The why to kick the pitch. Right side, hard hit. Fair ball. Digging it out of the corner. Short into second, and he's got a double. Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. Worked himself into a good count. I really like that swing, man. He didn't just push it the other way through the infield. He drove it that way, and it kind of makes me think he was thinking opposite field as he stepped into the box. Got a pitch he liked, and he got it done. Swing and a high fly ball to left. Brennan makes the catch, and that'll do it. And welcome back. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's the catcher, Luke Maley. The 1-1. One -one. It really feels like we might be running out of time before a rain delay is called. This rain is not letting up. Yeah, and if we do get a delay, the unfortunate thing is the clock's going to start ticking on these pitchers, and they won't be able to keep their arms warm forever if it's a long break and going to have to exit this game a little early. Next pitch in the dirt, and the count's full. Ground ball up the middle. On to first. And the leadoff man set down in their half of the fifth. Well, Boog, after watching the first inning of this one, you would not have expected that this pitcher would be in such a groove and still in the ball game at this point. That one pushed foul out of play off to the left. Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's two away. So two down now. And now here is White Trenton White. Brooks. The 1-1. One -one. Good eye right there. And that one missing low. And the right hater deals. And that one wrapped foul. Lifted in the air, right field. Racing makes the catch. That is the inning. Welcome back. And stepping in is the speedy Jacob Robson. Here's a 1-1. Bunch it back towards the pitcher. And he beats it out. It's a bunt single to start the inning. Well, he saw an opportunity to drop a drag bond and made it work out. And now they've got some speed on first. So we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Next to hit, Riley Green. That one lifted to left. Brennan coming on. Great effort as he's able to haul it in. One away. So digging in, Josh Lester. Now batting, the first baseman. Now these guys definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if you could find a way to manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really important to getting back into this ballgame. Robinson leads off first with one away. On the ground, right side. And it goes just foul. Ground ball to first. Could be two. Fired to second. Back to first for two. And that'll do it. Back down for the bottom of the sixth, and there's a new pitcher on the mound, Miguel Del Pozo. It's his job to keep his team in the game. 
Well, at this point in the ball game, we're talking about middle innings and you need a little length out of this arm coming out of the bullpen. We'll see just how many outs he's able to give his skipper. Back here at the ballpark, bottom of the sixth inning, down the third baseman, Nolan Jones. That one ripped right center field. That's back. Pulls it in on the warning track. That's just a really nice catch on the run right there. He saved extra bases for sure. But the pitcher's his friend. He'll give him a second to catch his breath before he's ready to deal the next pitch. And here it comes. That one the other way. Short. Two up, two down. Two outs, base is empty. Will Brennan now at the plate. At the belt and fires. And now two and one. Check swing and he held up. Bounced up the middle. Base hit. And that extends the inning. Well, they call that an advantage count for a reason. You're so much more likely to get something you can handle. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Just shot it through the infield. Checks over to first. Back safely. And here is David Fry. Next offering in the dirt. And it's 2-1. and one. And a pitch. Fouls one off. Two and two. And down on strikes. Inning over. And welcome back. All set for the start of the inning. Here's the third baseman, Isaac Paredes. Up the middle, and it gets by him. Just kept it simple. Played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from, and there was just no one there to knock it down. A new arm into the game, the righty, number 36. Trying to protect this lead. Number 36. Next is the designated hitter, Daz Cameron. Right-handed reliever in there. And so now one and two. Well, the leadoff man gets on. You want to minimize the threat by playing sound defense. Hopefully the pitcher can get a ball on the ground and they can roll him up for two. Check swing. Tried to hold up. Now an appeal to first. And that's a swing according to umpire Ed Drummond. So up next, number two. Next offering is down low. And he deals. Swing and a miss. Two and two. They haven't scored yet in this game. And with that swing, definitely trying to get on the board. That's the way guys go about their business today. Okay. That hits the dirt. Ball three. The guy at the plate could recognize slider out of the hand. Didn't stay in the tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. He knew right away it was an off-speed pitch. Base hit into center field. They get it in quickly. So first and second now, one out. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Here's Dustin Garneau. Next offering is foul back. Next one misses. It's two and two. And yeah, that's outside. Righty delivers. Grounder might be two. Jones over to second. Not in time at first. It's a fielder's choice. Ben Kraut gets the ball now and he'll do his best to hang on to this lead sure. 
back to the top of the lineup. Zach Short, the next to hit. Next pitch has popped up. Jones should have this one. He makes the grab, and that will end the inning. We're back in a new pitcher here to start the bottom of the seventh. Miguel Diaz. And he'll do his best to keep this close. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Now it's the second baseman, Ernie Clement. The wind of the pitch. And a base hit up the middle. And now the shortstop, Tyler Freeman. The pitch. And a foul ball, he stays alive. And a one-two again. Breaks his bat and pops it up. Lester puts it away, and there's one down. And now the catcher comes up to him. Luke Maley. The catcher. Luke. Maley. Got him swinging. He chased the changeup two away. So two down now, and here is number 67. Clement leads off first with two down to the inning. Next offering is in for a strike. And a pitch. Fouled off. He was late. The pitch. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. And that'll do it. We're at the top of the eighth. Now the number two hitter, Cody Clemens. Kicks and deals. Stays alive. Well, it's critical right here that they bear down and turn in some quality at bats, try to chip away at that lead, because if it gets to the ninth, that closer's coming in. And so the lefty allows the leadoff free pass. That could jumpstart an offense that's really struggled to score in this one. Don't want to wake a team up with the free pass. Left-hand batter waits. And that one is lifted in the air. Brennan under it. Makes the grab. And there's one down. Digging in, Riley Green. Now batting the center fielder. Riley Green. Swing and a bouncer. Goes to second. Safe there. Safe at first as they can't make the play. Now a right-handed arm out of the bullpen. Number 49. And he'll work on holding this lead. Two on, one out. Josh Lester digs in now. Got to keep things airtight defensively right here. On your toes, ready to make a play. If you can get this to the ninth with a three-run lead, it should be a W. The tying run at the plate. That's in there. One ball, two straight. One, two now. Slice the other way and foul. 
Runners at first and second with one gone. Gets under and pops it up. Freeman on the move. Makes the catch. And there's two down. So first and second with two outs. Now the third baseman, Isaac Paredes. The 1-1 is cut on and missed at a pitch upstairs. And the 1-2 misses to even the count. The next pitch misses. Three and two now. Fouled off again, and it remains three and two. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Bounce to third. Jones to first, and that'll do it. Ready for the bottom of the eighth, and now the right fielder, Trenton Brooks. And the righty deals. Stays alive. And down on strikes he goes. And that's one away as the leadoff man is out in the eighth. Nolan Jones getting ready to hit. The pitch. Hard on the ground to first. That's a fair ball down the right field line. And that rolls into the corner. The throw in. He's in at second with a one-out double. Here's Josh Naylor. Kicks and fires. Out towards right center field. Green moving back for this one. Puts the squeeze on that one. Two down. Here's the left fielder, Will Brennan. The left fielder, number seven. Next pitch, not close, up high. Two outs, and one in scoring position. So now two on, and two outs. Man, that's a tough one to take on the full count, but I guess he saw it really well. It's a really nice plate appearance. Now it's going to be David Fry for the fourth time tonight. Here's a 1-1. And it's fouled away. The one two. Got him looking. Third out. We're back, and on the mound is the closer, James Karen check. Number 99. All set to start the ninth in this one. And now the DH, Daz Cameron. And the pitch. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Karen check. He's known as a reliever that excels in really tough situations. Those high leverage spots. It seems like he's at his best in these situations. And obviously the ability to get the strikeout factors in. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And they get the leadoff man in the ninth. Now it's the right fielder, number two. Yeah, there are certain guys that expect to come in and dominate. And they see the challenge, the battle, just a little bit differently. 
They trust their stuff, and they believe that their stuff is better than that guy standing in the batter's box, what his swing, what his ability is. They're not ready to go home quite yet. Now Dustin Garneau will hit next. The mental approach is a big factor, too, isn't it? Yeah, Boog, it is. And, you know, for each guy, it can be a little different. Some people consciously work on focusing, slowing things down, breathing techniques. And then there's some players that are just natural, and they just seem to be more composed and less excitable. Whoa, Next pitch man. is in the dirt. Two balls, two strikes. And the right-hander deals. So here we go. Base runner at first. Could be running on the pitch. He's got good enough speed to steal the bag to get in scoring position, even if it's a swing and miss at the plate. The 3 2 is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Well, this could be the start of something. They haven't found a way to score yet, but now's their chance to change that. Now it's the shortstop, Zach Short. Next offering is in for a strike. A lot of times with relievers, they just like to get amped up and they're not really looking to try and slow it down, right? They're just trying to get hyper. Yeah, and perhaps make that hitter a little hyper and make him more aggressive. And that way, when they put a wrinkle, change speeds, he's out in front just a little bit. Chases that one out of the zone. Two gone. So first and second with two outs. Here's the second baseman, Cody Clemens. Two on, two outs, and just hacking like you used to. Yeah, kind of same, just like that, yeah. Down to their final strike. And a foul ball. One and two now. Next offering is outside. Tying run at the plate. Line drive. And that's a base hit. Right past his coach, headed for the plate. Relay throw. Not in time. He's safe at the plate. And it's now a two-run game. Big RBI for him right there. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages, working on going to the opposite field. And it doesn't always translate into the game. But right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Next offering way off the plate. Yeah, I'm surprised we didn't see a visit from the pitching coach here. Just to remind him, focus on the hitter. Don't worry about anything else. And now it's three and two. At this point in the game, you cannot issue free passes. He's going to have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. it. Is just one strike away. So both runners should be on the move here on the full count pitch. Yeah, this is a good chance to tie up this ball game. See if he can find some open grass in the outfield. In the air, out towards right center. Ball game. Well, not all saves come easy, but he didn't let things unravel. Good win for the boys today. And your final 3-1 for Chris Singleton and our entire crew. I'm John Chompy saying so long.